All right, I figured I would start with my DIY bridge here. Okay, first order is to clear space. All right, we have a clear path and we're gonna be able to take the golf cart across this hopefully here soon. So we dug the holes three foot deep. And we did three of them. Okay, we've leveled it both sides. And now we're tamping and putting in quick creep. You really don't have to tamp much. measuring 16 foot from one end to the next we haven't put we dug the holes but we're measuring 16 foot okay now we are on this side and we put a little bit in and he's checking both sides make sure it's completely level Last one will be the middle hole. So from there to here is exactly 16 foot. And we made sure these are aligned. Quick crete at this. I've got to quick crete the middle one. And then next we are gonna bolt on this. That is exactly 74 inches from this end to that end. drilling the holes for the baseboards. Okay, so now we're drilling, we pre-drilled all these. And we uh, put the bolt in here so we can use this. because our drill wasn't long enough. Okay. All should align. And then that, the bolt will go right through there. a little bit better on the grip and that's what we're drilling through. the 
Okay, a fun fact at the <laughs> end here is that you gotta make sure your first board at the beginning is perfectly straight or you're gonna come off just a little bit. Oh. And then I had a 16 foot two by four and I just set it on top because it was exactly 16 foot and screwed in both sides. Okay, so they say the average height of a railing is 36 inches. So I measured 35 because I'm putting this on top. Got an inch to make it 36. Okay, last thing I did was measured and cut each of these at 34 inches and placed them under and screwed them. That is a wrap. I'm obviously gonna fill this in with rock right here. So put that nice piece on the end for a nice clean finish. And cut these off, nail them on. Screwed, just inch and a half screws. Four of them went in the side here. Probably not the correct way to do it, but I couldn't get it from the bottom, so I had to go in from the side. And then for this board, Thing. For this board, I'm just gonna do inch screws all the way through to the end. It's just sitting on the corner for a nice clean finish.